Hello friends, welcome to Ultra Pixels. If you like our channel, please don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and press the bell icon for getting further notifications. Hi friends, this is a 55 inch BU LED TV. Here in this TV, the complaint is lines appearing on the display. See friends, this is the panel. It's a 55 inch AU panel. This is the motherboard and this is the power supply board. Here in this panel, the Tcon board is integrated in the motherboard. See friends, in this panel, here you can see two FFC cables. The one FFC cable to the right side of the panel and the other to the left side of the panel. This FFC cables are connected directly to the motherboard. Here actually, the Tcon board is integrated in the motherboard see friends now we turned on the tv now the tv is released from the standby see friends in the picture here you can see lines appearing on the screen see friends here you can see a lot of horizontal lines on the screen see friends there are thick horizontal lines on the screen See friends, this is the fault. These types of complaints are mainly due to internal shorting in gate signals inside the glass panel. The shorting may be either from the left side or right side of the glass panel. If both sides of the panel is short, then it is not repairable. Then panel replacement is the only solution. See friends, at present condition, here you can see the display shows thick lines on the screen. See friends. So, this is the issue that is related with the panel due to internal shorting in gate signals. So, let us start the repair. To repair, first we need to block the gate signals either from the left side or the right side of the glass panel. So here first I am going to remove the FFC cable from the right side of the panel. See friends, now I removed the right side FFC cable from the motherboard. Now let us turn on the TV and check the half side of the picture is ok or not. See friends, now the right side FFC cable is disconnected from the motherboard. So, now let us turn on the TV. See friends, now the TV is turned on or released from the standby. See friends, now the TV display works on the left side FFC cable. And here you can see the final result. See friends, the left side of the picture shows clear. There is no lines on the screen. See friends, there is no horizontal lines on the left side of the screen. Here you can clearly see that the picture is crystal clear. There is no horizontal lines appearing on the left side of the screen. So this means that the problem is with the right side gate signal tracks. Here the gate signals in the right side of the panel is short due to internal shorting. So the reason for lines appearing is because of the shorting in the gate signal tracks in the right side of the panel so to solve this issue we need to block the gate signals entering to the panel through this FFC cable for that here you need to block the marked lines as on the video see friends in the video we have shown the marked lines for blocking the gate signals using a Taping method, we can block these gate signals entering to the panel and prevent shorting. So friends, here I take a small piece of cello tape for blocking the gate signals entering to the panel through this FFC cable 
see friends using this small tape here I'm going to block the gate signals entering to the panel See friends, now we fixed the tape in the FFC cable for blocking the gate signals entering to the panel. See friends, these are the marker lines to block in the left side gate signals. See friends, finally now the work is done. Now we need to reconnect the FFC cable back to the motherboard. See friends, now we reconnected the FFC cable back to this motherboard. So, now let us turn on the TV and check the picture is okay or not. See friends, this is just only temporary solution. The permanent solution is panel replacement. See friends, now the picture is crystal clear. Here you can see the final result after blocking the gate signals. Now there is no horizontal lines appearing on the screen. See friends, now the lines are gone and the picture is crystal clear. So now the TV is repaired successfully. Here you can see the result. After blocking the gate signal tracks from the right side FFC cable. Now the internal shorting is removed from the panel from the right side. You can see now the picture is crystal clear and the TV is repaired successfully. If both sides of the panel is short then panel replacement is the only solution. After all this is just only temporary solution. The permanent solution is panel replacement. At the end of the video I will show you the gate signal tracks in both left side and right side of this panel. See friends in this picture the marked lines are the gate signal tracks from both left and right of the panel finally you can see the final result now the tv works properly without any lines on the tv screen so that's it hope you like this video if you like our channel please like share subscribe and press the bell icon for getting further notifications see you in another video with another interesting topic so thanks for watching